Hey guys, me again with another YouTube video. Um, today is actually another LED tutorial. So we have our blank canvas of LED pulled up. And I thought I'd teach you guys how to quickly paint something. The quick way. Um, so I'm going to quickly... Oh, we're not. Um, we're going to go to my room. We're going to get... Our magical case. Um, so since I lost my flash drive and all my LDD models on it, I went ahead and hard copied it into this. So uh, so yeah. I have a hard copy basically of all my Lego creations. It only took up to there on the CD. Um, I'm expecting to fill up the CD in the next year or so. So, yeah. And then we're going to have to wait for a little bit for that thing to pop up. So, yeah. Um, as I said, I'm going to teach you guys how to quickly paint something. And by that I mean if you have... Um, model that's all one color that you don't really like I'm gonna teach you how to quickly paint that so that it's not that color anymore Whew. I got a slight cold so I'll, I'll probably like run out of breath really fast if you guys haven't noticed um, if you guys want to see some calculations this is my uh, Calculations for a vault that I made in uh, Minecraft. So yeah, well, Tech it actually. I don't play Minecraft anymore. I play Tech it now because Tech it's way better personally. Um. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and open up. We're gonna do something that you guys have already seen, so you're not really seeing anything that I haven't showed yet. We'll do. I can't think of something to do for some reason. How about we go ahead and do the, um, damn. Yeah, here, we'll go ahead and do this one. Okay, so, as you can see, this model looks pretty crappy with all this horrible paint, doesn't it? I'm pretty sure you just said yes. So we're going to fix that. Um, what you're looking at is a Star AUG, by the way. It's the updated version that I've done. And we're going to fix the fact that it looks like absolute crap with this red and white pattern here. So yeah. Um, you're going to want to come up here to your magical toolbar. And you're going to want to click the one that's right here. So the one that is the fourth one from the left. You're going to click that. And you're going to come down here and you're going to click on any color that you want to select. And I just clicked red, so it selects every single red brick in your model. Then you want to come to the paint, you're going to come to your color, and you're going to click on whatever color you want. Let's say I just want to make it all the same orange. So you click orange and they all turn orange. Um, so yeah, let's say I want to take this white and make it into a dark red. So as you can see it took all that white and made it into a dark red. Let's say I want to make this silver into a black. Now it's all black. So that's basically all you need to know when it comes to um, painting this. Um, let's say you want to make everything the same color as the base of the weapon. You just Select the color that's the same color. Now we move on to the red one. Select it. So now it's all one gray color besides the magazine, the trigger, the bolt, and the EOTech. And that's basically all silver. Uh, another good thing, since this entire model is silver, and it would probably take you a good 20 minutes to go over every single bit of this to make it look correctly, just doing, you know, 
one brick at a time by hand just going through and doing this 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 and this and this over and over and over again that's probably going to take you a very very long time therefore what you do is do what I just showed you and that's the practical purpose of all this the practical purpose of doing what I'm showing you is being able to change the entire color of this model in about four seconds and that was pretty impressive that certainly it saves time painting everything and you can switch colors instantly so if you don't like this red for example actually it looks pretty cool but if you don't like this red you can easily switch it to purple in a few clicks as you can see it's pretty easy um yeah so that's basically the, how you use it. All you do is come up to this tool right there, this tool, the fourth one from the left, click it, select whichever color you want down here, go to your paint bucket tool, select which color you want out of here, and then you just click on that color and there you go. You have this entire model or that entire color that you don't like anymore, that other color that you chose. So I can go from red to purple in a few seconds. It's pretty useful. I like it, and this has been my LEGO Digital Designer tutorial number 7, I believe. So, uh, have a good day, guys. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe to videos like this one. I'll see you guys later.